Hello everyone, let's walk through the steps in installing factory side moldings on a Subaru Impreza. What we have here is a 2022 Subaru Impreza, it's sapphire blue, four door sedan. I ordered Subaru Genuine Accessories. These particular body side moldings fit the Impreza and the Crosstrek. They are factory matched to the color of your car, so the last two digits of the part number could be different. It's odd that the kit does not include printed instructions. You're going to need to find a site to download them. Before you begin, clean the area thoroughly to remove all dust and grime. This is absolutely important. Then you're going to identify the body character line. That's that little change in the body panel. You're going to start with the driver's side template and you're going to put masking tape or painter's tape in some of the square holes, just a couple of them to get started. You will notice the template has a little tab at the top and bottom to align with the door gap. Now align the top of the template with the character line and ensure that the door gap tabs are still centered. Once you're confident the template is properly aligned, use your masking tape or painter's tape to hold it down firmly in place. Use the supplied alcohol wipes to give the area one last cleaning. You can now unpack the four trim pieces and you will notice that each piece is clearly identified. We're going to start with the front left trim piece. From here, you're going to remove the first few inches of tape film on both ends. You'll see why it's important later in the installation process. Starting at the door gap, you're going to align the trim piece to the bottom of the template. Since the adhesive is only exposed on the ends of the trim piece, it makes alignment much easier. Carefully pull on the tape film while holding the trim in place. You can make small adjustments to the trim pieces as you pull the tape film off. Once you're satisfied with the fit, use a microfiber cloth and apply gentle pressure along the trim to ensure proper adhesion. That's it, the first trim piece is in place and now we move on to the rear panel. To attach the rear door template, simply line up the notches of the front piece with the character lines on the top. With the rear template aligned and in place, you can now proceed to install the rear trim piece using the same method we'd used for the front. Once you're satisfied with the position and the alignment of the rear trim piece, gently pull back on the top adhesive film. With the adhesive film removed, gently apply a bit of pressure on the top trim just to hold it in place, and then repeat the process for the lower portion. The final step, use your microfiber towel to apply even and consistent pressure on your trim piece, and that's about it. The installation on the driver's side is complete. Now we're ready to repeat the process on the passenger side of the car. You're going to reuse the driver's side templates, but on the passenger side, you're going to mount them so the printed side faces inward. Be sure to line up the door gaps, and don't forget the character line for the top part of the template. That's about it. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to hit the like button.